Hello everyone, welcome to my channel, Rita's Vlog USA. In today's video, I'm gonna show you our Rudbeckia Herta or the Black Eyed Susan. So what is Black Eyed Susan? The Black, eye, Black Eyed Susan refers to the dark brown center of its daisy-like flower head. It is a member of the Aster family. Black eyed Susan has daisy like rays of bright yellow petals and dark center disc. This wildflower is native to the central United States and can be seen growing in natural areas and along roadsides in the Midwest. Isn't that beautiful? Butterflies, bees, and other insects are attracted to the flowers for the nectar. As they drink the nectar, they move pollen from one plant to another, causing it to grow seeds that can be moved easily with the wind. Black-eyed Susan are deer-resistant plants. The species name Herta means hairy and refers to the short bristles that cover the leaves. The native species are often found in priory across the United States. In our property, my husband just broadcast the seeds once and then once they grow, it keeps blooming every year. The number of black-eyed Susan that blooms every year varies. Like last year, there's only a few of them blooming, but this year, it's a blast. You can see a blanket of yellow flowers in our property. I can't really tell you how to grow or care for this flower because like I said, my husband just broadcast the seeds one time. Then they keep coming back and blooming every year. Like other wildflowers, they don't usually bloom or fully grow in the first year. Um, each wildflower in our property has its own season or um, time to bloom. Once daisies are done blooming, black-eyed Susan comes next. These are summer flowers and they like full sun. And just as humans enjoy the beautiful bold flowers, butterflies, bees, and other beneficial insects are also attracted to Rubicchia herta. I hope you enjoy watching the beautiful black-eyed Susan as I give you a tour around our property.
video thank you so much for watching please don't forget to give this video a thumbs up if you like wildflowers and for more wildflowers video please subscribe to my channel rita's blog